All right, y'all, here we are. We're back again at the Graveyard Speedway. I got to start in the back of the pack. We went BMX racing for my son. He had a state race today, so we kind of got here after the heat races, so to the back we go. I'm not real sure that I'll be able to pull the day off like him. We unloaded his stuff off the back of the minivan, and he went straight to the front with no qualifying, heat race practice, no nothing. I'm not so sure I can pull that off, but we'll see what happens. Ryder drove his butt off today to win his race. Not so sure that I'm going to pull that off, like I said, but I think he's starting to think he's faster than me. And he might be. He might just be. So Ryder helped me with my commentating here, and apparently for my notes it says that I'm supposed to... I'm not that fast as Ryder on his favorite turn. He is faster than me on that turn. And he says he likes it because he is faster on that turn and he is super fast on that turn near the graveyard. Good luck. You made sure I got that in there, huh? Okay. So apparently I had to add that part in there, being he's helping me do my, my commentating. So here we go. The race is going to get started in a second. We'll try to get this thing underway. Alright, so we're going to see if we can make our way to the front without getting any wrecks. That'll probably be hard. And there goes some dirt on the, on the camera. That's, I guess, when you're in the back of the pack, that's what happens. See if we can make our way on through. It always tends to stick dirt right in the middle of the camera. Got us a few positions there. A little close racing going on there, a little bumping and grinding. There goes Dan there in front of us. Ooh. I think he got the bad end of that when that guy spun around, he tagged him. Looks like we'll probably get us a caution. Yeah, the flag's out. They'll probably line us back up. Hopefully we can continue to make our way to the front of the pack. like we're lying back up. Hopefully we can get the race underway. Good little crowd in the class. Looks like we're going on. See if we can't make up a few spots. Got 
got on through there somehow. I don't know how. I think we're sitting in third at this point, maybe. They stepped on out there. I think old boy in the red card, I think he's leading. I think Gibson sitting in second. Looks like we got another crash, so we're going to get a yellow and line them back up, which might help me a little bit because they had jumped out pretty good with that restart. Man, you buy a camera, it looks 360 degrees, and the dirt has to get stuck right in the center of it every time. I guess that's what I get for being in the back. Got Gibson in, in the second, and the old boy in the red car, he's up front. I think his name is Marshall. Pretty good kid. In the last few races we ran, we were first and second. Hopefully we'll get the green flag and we'll start back riding. Don't think we're gonna get it that time around. One more lap. Give me a little windshield wiper on the camera clean my dirt off. A little bumpity bump from back there. And here we go. These two boys here pretty quick. I can't do a whole lot with them. I can push a little harder in the sharp corner there. I can run it in hot and catch them, but that's about all I can do. My stuff's bumping the governor about halfway around there, and I can't. That's all she wrote. They just pull away. We trying to, we trying. Looks like there goes the white flag. We got one lap to try to do something. I don't think it's gonna happen. We're running a little hot there. I can almost get under him. It ain't really worth crashing nobody on the last lap over. We come around and we take third. That'll work. No practice, no heat race, no nothing. I'm happy with that. I didn't do as good as Ryder. He won his race. 
and I've had to hear that, but I'm happy for the old boy in the red cart. He needed him one. We've run first and second for quite a few weekends, and he's drove me clean. It's about time he got him one. There we go. Pretty cool stuff. And a big thanks to everybody at the Graveyard Speedway for getting the track right and everything. They put a bunch of work in this place so we can come out and run in circles in the dirt and have fun. Y'all check them out.